Mr. Speaker, in a staggering act of arrogance, Deputy Campaign Manager Andrew Prescott started bragging about the crime the Conservative campaign in Guelph was about to commit. Prescott sent out a message on Twitter that voter suppression was underway in Guelph two days before it happened. Prescott even flaunted their plans to reporters in Ottawa. This was a premeditated election crime. Mr. Speaker, why is it taking so long for the Conservative government to fess up and tell the truth? Who are they protecting? Mr. Speaker, the allegations of voter suppression in Guelph, we've heard them from many sides, but they're serious. Uh, and, uh, and we expect that Elections Canada will, in fact, look into this matter. If the allegations uh, prove true, Mr. Speaker, we would expect those responsible are held fully accountable. And the Conservative Party, as I've indicated many times, Mr. Speaker, is, of course, fully assisti assisting Elections Canada. It's the opposition parties that aren't. Yeah, I the thing is that Andrew Prescott had already started planning and blaming the other parties for this crime. Prescott wrote, quote, Voter suppression phone calls currently underway in Guelph while blaming the Liberals, very similar to the talking points being used by the Parliamentary Secretary on a daily basis. The fact is, this was an organized election fraud, and as much as they like to deny it, the Conservative Party is the only one under investigation, not the Liberals, not the NDP. When are they going to stop blaming others and take some responsibility? When will they start being honest with Canadians? Yeah.